Hello dear students, welcome to YouTube channel Learn with Gizla. In this video of polynomials, we shall be taking question 9 of exercise 2.5. So here in question 9, we have to verify x cube plus y cube is equal to x plus y in bracket and another bracket is there x square minus xy plus y square. Then we have to prove x cube minus y cube is x minus y into x square plus xy plus y square. Right, and for proving this, we have to use the identity 6 and 7, which are cubic identities, x plus y whole cube and x minus y whole cube. Now, what is x plus y whole cube? It is x cube plus 3x square y plus 3xy square plus y cube. Now, if you take the middle terms and take 3xy common, you are left with x plus y, right? Now, when you have x minus y whole cube, then it is x cube minus 3x square y plus 3x y square minus y cube. Now, again, if you take minus 3x y common, in bracket, you are left with x minus y and minus y cube as it is. Right. So these two identities, 6 and 7, we are going to use to verify these two questions. Right. Now, question 9, first part, we have to verify x cube plus y cube is equal to x plus y into x square minus xy plus y square, right? Now, over here, x cube plus y cube is there. So, we will use the identity which has plus sign, cubic identity which has plus sign. x plus y whole cube is x cube plus y cube plus 3xy into x plus y. Now, this whole term 3xy into x plus y, we will take on the left hand side and it will become minus 3xy into x plus y, right? And x plus y whole cube as it is. And on the right hand side, x cube plus y cube is already there. Now, if you observe, this is x plus y whole cube, right? Raised to power 3. Here, x plus y whole raised to power 1. So, can we take x plus y whole raised to power 1 outside? So, from here, if 1 is taken outside, what is left out of 3? We are left with 2. Yes, so th therefore we can say x plus y whole square inside the bracket. And then minus 3xy is left because x plus y is already taken outside. Right? So now 3 minus 3xy is inside the bracket. And right hand side as it is x cube plus y cube. Now let us solve it. x plus y whole square. We will use identity a plus b whole square, which is a square plus b square plus 2ab. So accordingly, we will write over here x plus y as it is. x plus y whole square can be written as x square plus y square plus 2xy and minus 3xy as it is, right? And x cube plus y cube also as it is. Now, if you observe 2x over here, 2xy and minus 3xy, will give you minus xy. So, x square minus xy plus y square, right? And already we have x plus y. Over here, we have x cube plus y cube. And this is what we had to find. We had to find x plus 3, sorry, x cube plus y cube is equal to x plus y into x square minus xy plus y square, right? So, this we have proved by taking identity x plus y whole cube. We have proved that x cube plus y cube is equal to x plus y into x square minus xy plus y square, right? Now, same is the case with part 2. Here, we have to prove x cube minus y cube is x minus y into x square plus xy plus y square. Now, because it is x cube minus y cube, so we will use the identity which has minus sign. Right, so x minus y whole cube is equal to x cube minus y cube minus 3xy common. So inside the bracket we have x minus y, as I told you before when I explained the identities. Now minus 3xy, if we take on the other side, right? If we take on the left hand side, it will become plus plus 3xy x minus 1 x minus y. Sorry, over here x minus y whole cube is already there. Here the power is 1. So, let us take x minus y raised to power 1 outside. So, out of 3, what will be left? 2. Okay. So, 1 x minus y whole square is left. Over here, plus 3 xy will be left. 
and x cube minus y cube as it is right now we will use identity a minus b whole square which is equal to a square plus b square minus 2ab to solve this x minus y whole square right so accordingly we will write <coughs> x minus y as it is now x square plus y square minus 2xy it is same as a square plus b square minus 2ab the only difference is a and b here it is xy here it is ab that is the only difference so x square plus y square minus 2xy and plus 3xy as it is now minus 2xy and plus 3xy isn't it xy plus xy right so this is what we wanted x minus y as it is then x square plus y square and minus 2xy plus 3xy is plus xy is equal to x cube minus y cube right so this we have proved that x cube minus y cube is equal to x minus y into x square plus xy plus y square right so this is it children hope you have understood both the parts of question 9 in the next video i will be taking question 10 thank you everyone have a great day ahead